Amen. This is Pablo Ferro. <gasps> Bam! He got shot in the neck. Pablo was on life support. He was going to die. Hello. He was at Minister of the Last Rites. The ground shift. May I have your attention, it's please? Shifted. We thought it was somebody was out to get us. We didn't know why. May I have your attention, please? Thank you. Who is Pablo Ferro? I had the feeling he was a bit of a gypsy. It had to be an artist or somebody very strange. Something about the essence of Pablo Ferro. He's like certain shamans, you know. He's a true artist. He's like a walking work of art. Somebody like that came over from Cuba when he was 12 years old and never wore shoes before. Came to New York City. You have to know what happens when an atomic bomb explodes. He was Kubrick's guy. One of those guys that has a kind of a legendary aspect. Give it to Pablo and leave him alone for two weeks. We'll come up with something. A big tribute is going on tonight for a Hollywood movie master by the name of Pablo Ferro. You may not know the name, but I bet you know the work. Been in a movie theater in the past 40 years, you've seen Pablo Ferro's work. The greatest credits ever seen on any film. I don't care what the budget was, what the film was. These are the great credits. You've got to be crazy. This is as great as life gets. This was never, never lad. There was no time in Pablo's apartment. Sometimes he would just be there for days. It was just like part of a scene of a movie. This is Pablo Ferro. Who, who was it? I just said to him, Pablo, you know what? It's okay for you to be gorgeous. It doesn't mean you have to be invisible. The only thing you can depend on is that all things are going to change. The sooner you throw yourself into the sea of change, the better off you're going to be. You just roll along. <laughs> you escape destiny. Pablo who?